it's gonna be normal. Is that fine? Hey, I'm um... the boss. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, gorgeous. This is the fairy voice mother, and I'm Holly Hannigan. <laughs> Some of you may recognise Holly from the recent live stream that we did. If you were there, you would recognise her because she hasn't changed since then. <laughs> we met at uni. I remember getting to uni thinking like, oh, I don't want to make any friends. Like, everyone was so kind of really cool and kind of aloof. And I was like, oh, we just laughed at the same thing. I thought, yes, <laughs> finally, <laughs> someone understands me. Here she is. Here we are. In the fairy cave. Oh. Not a euphemism. Today, we are going to be reacting to Electric Callboy performing Hyper Hyper. Again. Hyper Hyper? Or is it Heeper? That okay. sounds more Swedish. I <laughs> I'm actually really excited. Like, I'm looking at this and I'm just thinking, what, what, what is going to happen? What is it? Do you want a bit of your tea? Go for it. Do you like soy milk? Have you had it before? I like uh, almond milk. Oh, do you? Mm. Right, do you want your Yummy. specs for this? I think I will because I'm getting a bit of a eye ache. Supervision okay. engage. It looked like a workout video. It did Until look it exactly like that. And he not looks even like the man from Tiger King. Yes, he does look like him. Yeah. I love the fire is in his yeah. belly. <laughs> <laughs> and also, I mean, they're clearly wigs. Do you think they're real mullets? Okay. I don't think they're real mullets. Mm. Surely not. Surely not. Surely not. So many okay. vocal tombas, tambas. How do you say Tombra. that? Yeah, I just say uh, textures. <laughs> <laughs> There's some growling in that already. Can you hear it? Do it again. Oh, yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, it's like they've laid it though with the with the clean vocal as well, exactly. haven't they? Like, four, four play. No, <laughs> four shadowing. shadowing. Four play. The way they've laid it is very impressive, and there's actually a lot of skill and consideration musically. Like it's noisy, but it's very deliberate noise. It sounds like a crowd <laughs> chat, like singing actually, doesn't it? Yeah. Like a gig. If you want it to sound like a big crowd, you can do that with one person. But if you just stand uh, several different positions away from the mic you get different kind of room sounds. Oh, that's such a good idea. And that combined with like a few different larynx positions, if you do Medicaid me, and then Medicaid me, all of a sudden, Jesus, like, this you've is got a rave. Well, 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 you learn something new every day. Have like, you tried grouse before? No, I've never tried it, no. Do, try to like clear your throat with volume. Like. <laughs> <laughs> Are you ready for this? <laughs> So you see that? I think that was fine. Like, that didn't even, like, I was no, it doesn't. It doesn't hurt. So I've tried it before, and I've just coughed straight after. That's too much air pressure. Yeah. Well, it's good to get used to that. <coughs> those are your false faults yeah. making the okay. little grumbly sounds, yeah. and then from there you can do all kinds. Of <laughs> so, <laughs> but how do you sing it like that then? Well, you want to modulate your vowels. Mm. You want to modulate away from your long vowel gradually to other vowels, right? Mm -hmm. So if we start with O. <laughs> There you go. Yeah. Does that feel okay? That's fine. Same so from or to er. Okay. That's it. That's literally it. Oh my god, it. <laughs> Sing a song right. I know why I'm going to be met like I did it. Hello. It's generally quite difficult to perform intelligible lyrics on a ground. Yeah. Because yeah. you have to modulate your vowels so they're or. Oh. Oh, there's a fire on the floor. The process is happening fire so. On the floor. Oh. All I can remember is hyper hyper. That means it's a good hook. It does, doesn't it? It's so good. It's so good. <laughs> You're pretty and I like you. <laughs> <laughs> With this combination of the the more melodic or clean singing and then the growls, it does sometimes give you the impression that it's someone doing like a pitched scream. 
potentially, yeah, like yeah. a fry scream. Yeah. But I actually don't think that's necessarily what's happening. I think it gives that illusion, but I actually think it's two singers. Sort of a chanty, slightly yeah, dirty, so. belty sound, and then the growl underneath. Yeah, that's what I think. Yeah, definitely. Because obviously you've got all the other layers around it, it's hard to tell, isn't it? Yes. But no, I think... You should press the play button. <laughs> <laughs> oh, hang on. Oh, oh it's going... <laughs> This is how like trying to keep challenged I am. I'm like getting the mouse like oh it's the space bar. <laughs> I played you this. You'd think it was a metal song. Yeah, you would, absolutely. But it's like section, section, section. That bit before when it's going, no, no, no. Well, it's like, you know, like you're in IB for something. Yeah, exactly. And then suddenly, you're, you're in, like, in a dungeon underground. In I know. Yeah. Oh, they could have, like, had a complete look change. Don't you think that like, they could have? Yeah, they could have. Like, I feel like this would have been cool if they'd maybe, like, they'd gone for the 80s thing at the beginning and then now this section here where it's, like, really heavy metal. Mm. They should have gone yeah. for the heavy metal look. Yeah, they should have. Not I am Addicted to your sweat, did it say that? <laughs> addicted to your spine, I thought you said. <laughs> I don't want to be addicted to my spine when I've got this bulge. <laughs> addicted to your smile. Your smile, that does make more sense. <sighs> <sighs> play that when you were little. <laughs> like, like, on holiday at Butlins, so like, well, hey, bong. I feel like you don't need to have that kind of acute spatial awareness and coordination required to catch a ball. No, you don't. With hands. <laughs> Some artists like there's just something about him when you watch them. Oh, he is very engaging. Absolutely, he's got very strong quads <laughs> <laughs> and a strong tash as well. <laughs> a very strong tash. You like a little slidey riff. Yeah. Sometimes kind of cute. I don't know why. And you know it's so not auto tune that way. You you can't slide and auto tune. Is that right? It. Yeah, because it corrects. Of course you can't. Because I swear I see people doing it live as well. Does the mic do it automatically? Yeah, so you can have it, um, so the signal goes through the mic and then through a board yeah. and on which you can add plugins. Just the same way you can add reverb, you can add a word tune. It's risky though because if you're like, quite a lot out, that's going to be a big snap. Ooh, yeah. So you'll really hear it. Let them go, that's against the rules. No, I was going to say, if you're using it deliberately and you want that sound, I get that, but if yeah. you're using it to actually help yourself be in tune, yeah. you need it to be subtle and if you can... That's it. Right. A little bit of constriction. We've had open growls. We've had constriction and breath. And we've had uh, a little bit of high larynx um, backstreet voice. Yeah. These are vocal magicians. Wow. There's a lot of skill in that. So I'm still wondering, like, I feel like the blonde bloke's the main singer then, yeah? And he's kind of like doing a bit of the old... Uh, bit of the old growl a That they're, they're carrying it they are, oh, absolutely. nicely yeah, as, a, as a team. Yeah. Yeah. Like us. That's my class, yeah. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, it's so How their wigs not fall off with all this crazy like dancing? Maybe it's like they were then. There is a lot of commitment in other in other ways, so I wouldn't be surprised no. if it was real hair. Yeah. I mean, we like theatre though. <laughs> Sometimes we need a little bit of mystery. <laughs> the musical personification of Cyberdog in Camden, isn't it? <laughs> It's like a shop where everything's fluorescent and there's people like dancing on the ceiling. It's all fun and games, and then you go down one level 
it gets a bit suggestive. And then you go down another level, it gets less suggestive. Say no more. Or am I getting mixed up with Torture Garden there then? <laughs> Jesus Christ. Oh, my eye. Maybe put those bloody glasses back on. <laughs> <laughs> all the emotions are like all over the place in this song. Yeah. I like it though. It's a blue smart is bonanza. <laughs> but I feel like, yes, look at another fight. And yeah. then they go. Blueberries are actually purple. Yeah, exactly. And the sky is. I don't know what makes it blue. What is the sky? What makes the sky blue? <laughs> It's um artistically sexually charged. Yes, it is. Definitely. You know, because there's references, there's gyrations, but it's done in a fun, Comical accessible way. way. Yeah. And look. Tit tape. I love the tit tape. Nice. Yeah, that's beautiful. <laughs> so ladylike. I can't believe how easy you made distortion. I'm surprised. It's not smooth, but it doesn't feel um, scratchy or exactly. sharp. That is what you have to watch out for. It's like quite a soft, uh, bumpy feel. It's a, yeah, it's a bit of a rumble. That's the one. I remember um, people like, you shouldn't feel anything when you sing. Like, <laughs> I don't like it. <laughs> oh, okay, then I'll just... Of course you're gonna feel something. There's motion. I know. When you're moving tissue in a more um, aggressive way, yeah. obviously you're gonna feel more. So yeah. you are gonna have sensations, but they're not gonna be uncomfortable. Be honest. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't think I was gonna be able to do it the first time. It was just like, oh, okay. That makes so much sense. There are other types as well we can do. Yeah, I'd love yeah. that. Yeah. Uh, I'll need to practice that one. Yeah, it's already pretty hot. You're pretty hot. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, do you know what? I was not disappointed by that at no, all. No, not at all. I mean, it was a party anthem, it was a rave anthem, it was a uh, headbanger. Neon signs aren't cheap. Oh. They've put money into this. Let's not forget the wigs. Let's not forget. That drum kit, like, you completely destroyed that drum kit, didn't it? It was a sacrifice. That was terrific. It was. It was smashing. Yeah. Absolutely smashing. Bloody brilliant. I love that. Terrific. I love that. Oh, do you know what? I've had that for ages. Have you not? Oh, really? Terrific. Be interested to see how they would do it live. Would that chorus be as big if they've only got two singers? What I imagine they would do is um, have a backing track. A lot of different instruments as well. Obviously synths yes. are not necessarily synonymous with metal. No, uh, yeah. Right, so you've got a lot going on. It's massive. You've got the metal. You've got the metal. <laughs> I just think this is really well thought through. Like, they didn't just throw this together, you know? If you're trying to introduce someone to metal and they're like, I don't like metal, I don't like metal. Yeah. It's kind of like a good, it kind of like eases them in gently, doesn't it? A segue. My mum likes the human league. <laughs> I reckon <laughs> they could definitely do some growling in one of their songs. I was working as a waitress in a... Cocktail! <laughs> Heavy is fun. Upcoming. It is. Yeah, it's not all about Satan. That, you're such a good teacher. Honestly, I didn't think I could ever grow out. Oh my gosh. That's so good. I remember hearing someone say, like, imagine you've got cotton wool in your mouth. Oh, I've heard that. The thing is, right, you're you're playing an instrument you can't see, you're moving tissue you can't see. You know, like, different things work for different people, and two different people can think of two different things and get the same result. That is true. You're going to need to trigger it for a good while before you can just launch straight in. Yeah. And that's why using something that we do all the time, like clear our throat or cough, it's a way to activate those tissues. The same way that to activate, um, like, bell. Yeah. You would teach, yeah. Or cry. Or, yeah. <laughs> mm, sure. Exactly. Yeah. So thank you so much. Oh, you're welcome. That's <laughs> very voice friend. <laughs> I can go home feeling like I've you can't go enlightened home. myself. Oh, no, I'm not going home yet. Ever. Seven years ago. Yeah. I met you and now I'm very proud of the woman you've become. Oh. <laughs> I'm going to do my little spiel at the end or you can do it. No, you do it. <laughs> Thank you so much for watching this video. <laughs> what was next? I hope you enjoyed watching this as much as I enjoyed making it. <laughs> if you want to see anything. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe 
you not oh, anything? No, I... <laughs> I've lost the point. I have to. Please. Let us know. Oh yeah, let us know. Yeah, sorry. I'll... In the comments. Bye. Bye. Mwah.